Alright then guys, welcome to Terraria part 4 I think, yes part 4, and um, today I don't know what I'm going to do, in fact what I want to say before I start this properly is that I want this to be quite interactive LP, so if you leave in the comic section what you want me to do, if you want me to take on a specific boss or something, please do that, just whatever you want me to do in this LP, leave it in the comment section. If you watch my frame rate skip um, video, you'll understand why this is, looks a bit different than some LPs. I don't really think it's that much different actually. No, it seems to be going better than at the beginning of the video, frame rate skipping. But yeah, basically I showed people how to stop your terraria from going in slow mo, which I looked up on the internet. If you need help with that as well, oh wait, I have to turn this way, don't I? If you need help with that as well, please check out the video. All the information you need is on there. So now, I think actually I'm going to go down into this cave, see if I can get some more minerals. This is about the only thing I can do at the moment. Either that, or I could search for shooting stars, but since it's not night, I know there's no minerals in this cave, so completely useless. Waste of time. Sorry for wasting your time already. What can I say, that's just something I generally do. I love the music in this game. I mean seriously, whoever made that music is just, yeah, you should just get knighted, it's amazing. Ooh, go chop down some of these trees. I love how the wood falls in this game. Come on, look at that. Then again, wood isn't a very valuable resource, so I guess the fact that it's falling so fast isn't exactly, well, I get so much. Isn't exactly the best thing in the world, but you know, I like it. Come on, slimes. I wish <laughs> Sly Fox did a road to Heepo on this game. Literally taking like two seconds. And they'd have to murder Heepo. That would just be sad. Come on, give me a cave. I've been down this cave, but no. Yeah, it'll do. So, today we're going to be a cave explorers. You ready, guys? I know it's scary. But we can make it through this together. Is that it? Seriously. That was a pathetic cave. You don't even deserve to call yourself a cave cave. I better been in here before and took everything, haven't I? Damn you past self. You always screw me over. How the hell did I get out of this? Obviously not that way. Oh, you git. Uh, come on, work. Well, this is going well. <laughs> Let's try using stone. Stone always works, right? I think I should be. Oh, you git. There we are. About time I actually managed to make it up here. So, anyway, let's continue our search for a decent cave. Oh, mushrooms. I never really got. Oh, corruption. You know what? I'm gonna go down into it. Wait a minute, wasn't the corruption on the other side as well? So there's corruption on both sides of my world. That's useful. Ah, uh, that sounds like a recipe for death. I really need to make something to stop it. Whoa, crap! Attack faster, my man of not very good. Yes. I need more creative names. Okay, let's see if I can just kind of... Ooh, a pot. Jump down here slowly. That's oh, just a demon altar. I'm going to have to get rid of that above me, aren't I? Need to place a torch. That's another thing I... I really need to get some silver so I can get a merchant to move in. Oh, I can't get rid of this, can I? No, I can't. Crap. Uh. Hmm. That's just great. Oh, no, I didn't just do that, did I? Oh, 
You're an annoying worm. Go to hell. I desperate. I shouldn't have come down here, should I? Ow. Okay, then, after that absolutely massive fail, I vote we don't go that way again. <laughs> At least not until we get something, anything, that can fight off stuff like that. Also, oh, I just realised something. Even though I did get enough money, which I'm nowhere near. Oh, you, where the hell are all these worms coming from? Screw fighting, that sounds like something that somebody who was actually brave would do. I'm just gonna run for it. Come on. Go faster, me. Why are there so many worms? I thought worms only appeared in certain, very certain areas. I like the massive vines that come down from some places. I'm gonna have to turn around and fight one of these, aren't I? You'd think they wouldn't be able to travel through stone. I mean, solid stone. I understand being able to travel through grass and dirt and sand, but stone? Unless that thing is some kind of super worm, I don't think it can dig through stone. Or if it's got a pickaxe up its sleeve, which I guess is possible. <laughs> How can you not love the uh, music in this game? I guess it gets a bit repetitive after a while, but come on. Can you hear that? I'm not sure if you can. But if you can, come on, amazing music. Man, I need a cave. Also, I think the dungeon might be in this direction. Did we find corruption? I'm sure we found corruption in this direction. I can't even remember. We did, didn't we? Because I got flippers from over here. Yep, it's just beyond here, isn't it? I remember now. Ah, oh, that's some kind of cave. Oh yeah, I and mean, I have flippers, don't I? Screw you, water. You're not stopping me visiting this cave. Oh, the fact that there's no light might do that. There's nothing here. So yeah, water's my friend. Thanks to these flippers. You'd think you would put flippers on your feet. Maybe they give you a bit of protection. Ah, oh, great. Past me, screwed me over again. I suppose I can make that. No. There we are. Do I have anything else I can place underneath me as I go up? Yeah, dirt. Well, I'm about to go back into corruption, aren't I? Come on, there better be a cave somewhere. There's got to be a cave somewhere. Come on, give me a break. Please, I'm begging you. <laughs> Is that a cave? I'm sure I went into a cave at some point and got killed in there. Ah, oh, I just threw my sword. Ah. Uh. I'm not a word to be seen. You've got no idea I'm here. You're kidding me, I could have just dug through to here. Can I not place them on the roof? No. So what am I going to do? I'll try draining the water a bit then. Would have been smart to place a torch first. Okay, we're going to drain some of the water. Is that seriously how you drained enough? Yeah. <laughs> that was fast. Problem is, now that the zombies can... Oh no, the zombies can't just fall in. So yeah, that was perfect. Score. Yeah, I totally meant to do that from the beginning. Completely my idea. We're not going to be able to get back up there now, aren't I? am I? No, I am. As soon as I get rid of this copper. Actually, is there something down there? 
Well, at the very least, there's a pot. Let's take out my torch. Let's go exploring. Okay, there is something down there. Since I can't breathe forever. What I'm going to do, I'm going to try and make... Oh, no, I can't do that. Just yet. I'm going to try and make several little pockets. With a... Get a breath, make another pocket. Okay, this isn't going very well. Come on, this, this should be easy to make a pocket of there, sure. I know, I'll just dig straight down from here. Well, they really want to kill me. I mean, really want to kill me. Guys, give me a break. What did I do to you? You're seriously willing to basically sacrifice your own life to come after me. Okay. Now I have something there. No, that was a terrible idea. Actually. Now that I think about it. Let's try... There we are, now we've got another pocket there. We can travel further down. Okay, that was far too far down. There's obviously nothing in here, is there? Just a bunch of water. This to be a place that um, I can actually drain this water to a lot better. Let's see if I can just dig my way out of here. Get rid of some of this water. Crap. Thank God for that. So then guys, this is going absolutely great. I'm only dying every 10 seconds. So yeah, I actually think I'm going to end it here. I will see you next time.